Good morning, Hoover Elementary. Dr. G here on Hawk TV, wishing you all a very happy Wednesday. It's Wednesday. It's going to be a fun day. It's over the hump day. Woo, 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 woo. At this time, please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. At this time, please remain standing for a brief moment of silence. Thank you. You may be seated. Dun, dun, dun. All right, everybody. Wow, what a storm last night. I lost power down in Delaware. I know that there's some trees down. I know that there's been some wind and some rain. But the good news is Hoover's safe. Anybody who comes to Hoover today will be safe. We've got heat, we've got power, we've got our computers working. So we did have a two hour delay today. And the reason for that is so that everybody, all the teachers, staff, students can get here safely. All right. So let's try and run through what this day is going to be like. So today is uh, Wednesday. It's January 10th. It's day four, day four. Uh, but because it's a two hour delay schedule, it's almost like a math problem. If you normally come to school at 8.50, two hours later would be 10.50, right? Almost 11 o'clock. So you're probably thinking to yourself, okay, so if my bus normally comes at like 8.30, when's it gonna come? Well, ideally it would come somewhere around 10.30, but with some trees down and the roads the way they are, some buses might be a little late today, all right? So just know that. But know that we'll open our doors at 10.50 a.m. Now, get this, we're still gonna serve breakfast. So if for some reason you haven't had breakfast by 10.50, we'll stu still do breakfast from 10.50 to 11.10, all right? Now, we do a lot of stuff during the morning. Since we weren't here, a bunch of stuff's going to be canceled. So we will still have the opening. We will still have breakfast. But if you uh, are in third grade, you normally have specials in the morning. Well, there won't be those opportunities for specials. So if you're in third grade, no specials today. If you're uh, on the 1B team or the 2B team, and your teachers will tell you which team you're on, uh, there's no specials either because you normally have specials before 11 o'clock. Uh, also, we won't do recess today. We'll figure that like the time you had from 8.50 to 10.50, you probably had some running around in there. So that's when you got to do your recess. But I know everyone's like, oh my goodness, I really want to make sure I get lunch. Don't worry. We have a motto here at Hoover, everyone eats everyone every day. So the lunch schedule doesn't change. So you're probably scratching your head. I'm a first grader. I come in at 10.50. I grab my breakfast. I get to class by 11.10. When does first grade normally have lunch? Well, first grade normally has lunch at 11.15. So five minutes after you finish breakfast, if you're in first grade, you go right to lunch. And then everybody just has their normal lunch schedule. No recess, because like I said, we wanna try and pack in some academics today. And if you have specials basically prior to 11 o'clock, you won't have them today, all right? Now, I think it's a good idea for us all to kind of like stay uh, tuned to what's happening. Like right now, things seem to be pretty good, which is great. Um, we're scheduled for later today. There's a mad science program. That's not done through Nishamini. That's an outside agency. They are coming from New Jersey. If they're still coming, which I believe they are, that would be 3.30 to 5 in the art room. And then they would dismiss students at the A-wing doors near the staff parking lot around 5. If anything changes, we'll send out an email, let everybody know. And it also looks like tonight is the PTO fundraiser at Chipotle. I believe that's still going to go on. That's from 4 to 8. If for any reason that changes, we'll let you know. All right? So let's make sure today is a great day. Let's be respectful. Let's be responsible. Let's be safe. Let's also try and be really flexible because the whole day is just a little goofy. You know, some people might have slept late. Some people might not have gotten enough sleep. Some people might have been up for a while trying to like clear their driveways of trees and stuff like that. So let's really try and be kind. Have a great day, everybody.